what do you think about Lamont Roach and him? Oh, man. That's a good fight. After months of speculation, the boxing community finally has an answer to the burning question. Who will Javante Tank Davis fight next? In a surprising turn of events, Davis is set to face Lamont Roach Jr., the current World Boxing Association WBA super featherweight champion. This announcement has generated significant buzz across the sport, especially given the dynamics of their matchup and the timing of the fight. The choice of Lamont Roach as Davis's next opponent came as a shock to many fans and analysts alike. Following Davis's successful title defense against Frank Martin in June, his camp had been in discussions with several potential opponents, but securing a fight proved challenging. As the year progressed, it seemed increasingly unlikely that Davis would return to the ring before the end of the year, leaving fans anxious about his future bouts. Rick Glazer, a well-known boxing promoter and insider, broke the news via social media confirming that Roach would be moving up in weight to challenge Davis at lightweight. This bout is set to take place in December, potentially in the DMV area, given that both fighters are from Maryland. The announcement stirred mixed reactions. While some fans were excited about the matchup, others expressed disappointment at the choice of opponent. One of the reasons for the skepticism surrounding this fight is the significant weight difference between the two fighters. Fans have been anticipating a high-profile matchup against well-known contenders like Shocker Stevenson or Vasyl Lomachenko, making Roach's selection feel underwhelming in comparison. With a wealth of talent in the lightweight division, many believe that Davis deserved a more prominent fight that would showcase his skills against a formidable opponent. As the news broke, fans took to social media to voice their opinions. Some were optimistic, recognizing Roach as a scrappy fighter who could potentially give Davis a run for his money. Others, however, were far less enthusiastic. The prospect of Roach moving up from 130 to 135 pounds for a single bout raised eyebrows, with critics questioning the quality of the matchup and the direction of Davis's career. Despite the criticism, it's essential to note that Lamont Roach is no slouch. He has a solid track record, including a series of six victories, one of which was over Hector Luis Garcia, an opponent previously faced by Davis. Roach's fighting style is primarily focused on inside boxing, making him a dangerous competitor in his own right. However, the boxing community remains skeptical about whether this fight will live up to the expectations set by Davis's previous bouts. Adding to the intrigue surrounding this matchup is the reaction from other prominent boxers, including Devin Haney. Haney, who is part of a talented group of American fighters alongside Davis, publicly laughed at the news of Roach being Davis's next opponent. His reaction highlights the disappointment shared by many fans who were eager to see Davis in the ring against more high-profile challengers. In an unexpected twist, Haney also shared a post of himself getting hit by a left hook during a fight with Ryan Garcia, drawing a comparison between their respective bouts. Haney's comments emphasize the competitive nature of the lightweight division, and the desire for fans to see the best fighters face off against one another. Gary Russell Jr., another notable fighter, has also called for a match against Tank Davis. Russell expressed his interest in returning to the ring and is open to fighting Davis, citing the geographic proximity and shared history between the two fighters. Despite Russell's previous struggles with inactivity, his desire to face Davis has remained a consistent theme in his interviews. As the boxing community reflects on the potential match between Davis and Roach, it's clear that this fight could serve as a stepping stone for both fighters. Davis's management has faced scrutiny in recent years for the selection of opponents, often choosing fighters who are perceived as less challenging. Critics argue that this approach diminishes the excitement surrounding Davis's fights and prevents him from establishing himself as a true elite competitor in the sport. Although Lamont Roach may not be the dream opponent that fans were hoping for, he brings a unique skill set to the ring that could surprise Davis.
As both fighters prepare for this match, the anticipation continues to build, and boxing enthusiasts are eager to see how this matchup will unfold. Davis's return to the ring marks his second fight of the year, following a lengthy absence. The opportunity to defend his title against Roach presents an intriguing scenario for both fighters, allowing them to showcase their skills on a prominent stage. The fight is set to take place on December 21st, and discussions about the venue and undercard are ongoing. While many fans were looking forward to potential clashes against elite fighters, Davis's decision to fight Roach offers a chance for him to solidify his status as a champion. The matchup not only brings together two skilled boxers, but also highlights the complexities of navigating the competitive landscape of boxing. Roach's journey to this fight has been characterized by determination and resilience. Despite setbacks in his career, including a draw and a split decision loss to Jamal Herring, Roach has persevered and earned his place as a champion. His victory over Hector Luis Garcia showcased his potential and set the stage for this high-profile bout against Davis. In the lead-up to the fight, fans and analysts alike will be closely monitoring the developments surrounding both fighters. The dynamic between Davis and Roach promises to create an engaging narrative as they prepare to face off in the ring. The potential for an exciting showdown is palpable, and fans are eager to witness the outcome of this highly anticipated matchup. As the date approaches, the boxing community will continue to discuss the implications of this fight and what it means for the future of both fighters. While the choice of Roach as Davis's next opponent may have raised eyebrows, it also serves as an opportunity for both fighters to make a statement and demonstrate their skills to a broader audience. In conclusion, the announcement of Tank Davis facing Lamont Roach Jr. has generated a mix of excitement and skepticism within the boxing community. While some fans may be disappointed by the choice of opponent, there is no denying that Roach is a capable fighter who could potentially challenge Davis. As both boxers prepare for their upcoming bout, the anticipation continues to grow, and fans are left wondering what the future holds for both fighters in the ever-evolving landscape of boxing. Stay tuned for updates as the fight date approaches, and don't forget to subscribe for the latest news and analysis from the world of boxing. After months of speculation, the boxing community finally has an answer to the burning question. Who will Javante Tank Davis fight next? In a surprising turn of events, Davis is set to face Lamont Roach Jr., the current World Boxing Association WBA Super Featherweight Champion. This announcement has generated significant buzz across the sport, especially given the dynamics of their matchup and the timing of the fight. The choice of Lamont Roach as Davis's next opponent came as a shock to many fans and analysts alike. Following Davis's successful title defense against Frank Martin in June, his camp had been in discussions with several potential opponents, but securing a fight 